As we're sharing the gospel of Christ with people, there are some things we need to keep in mind when they simply are rejecting what we have to say. Now, this may sound really simple for us, but I think it's the place we have to begin. And number one, we must realize they're not rejecting me. <clears throat> they're rejecting the message. That leads us to remember that the gospel is still the power of God unto salvation to everyone that believes. We must keep in mind that the power is in the message and not in the messenger. The second thing we should keep in mind is the fact of the power of the Spirit of God to work upon the life of an individual. Uh, even after I have maybe disappeared, that if I'm wise, if I'm clever, and I say clever in the best sense of the word, in sharing the message, even though that person may reject it, if they reject it, they've had to hear it. So they can't reject something they haven't heard. So I can walk, I say walk away in a sense, with believing that the Spirit of God can still use the Word of God in my absence. And then maybe there's somebody else that comes along, right? Some water, some plant, some water, God gives the increase. 